Ember Smart Heating Control from EPH. The Setup Guide. The Ember app for remote access of your heating system is compatible with the R range RF programmers, which include R17 RF for one zone, R27 RF for two zones, R37 RF for three zones, and R47 RF for four zones. These programmers communicate by RF with wireless room thermostat and wireless cylinder thermostat, and they allow remote app control through a smart device, when used with a separate gateway unit. Ember 2 Zone Smart Control Setup EPH 2 Zone Smart Control includes a 2 zone wireless programmer, gateway, wireless room thermostat, and a wireless cylinder thermostat. Wireless Programmer Installation if the backplate requires wiring, please refer to the wiring instructions. With the power off, attach the wireless programmer to the pre-wired backplate, and tighten the fixing screws. Now the R27RF programmer is installed. Installing the wireless room thermostat. Press the button on the bottom of the thermostat to detach the housing from backplate and insert two AAA batteries. Then clip the front housing back. Mounting the wireless room thermostat. The thermostat can be mounted to the stand provided. Or wall mounted. Installing the Ember Gateway. Plug the mains power cable into the gateway. It will communicate with both the programmer and your internet router wirelessly. Pairing the gateway to the wireless programmer. Ensure your router is working off a 2.4 GHz frequency. Ember does not support internet routers with a 5 GHz frequency. On the programmer. Lower the front flap on the programmer. Press and hold the minus button for 5 seconds. The wireless connect screen will appear. Press and hold the plus button for 3 seconds. The code screen with four digits appears on the top left of the screen. On the gateway, press and hold the function button on the gateway until it flashes. The red and green lights will begin to flash simultaneously. R1 will appear on the programmer screen. Press the OK button on the programmer. The gateway and programmer are now connected. If R2, R3 or R4 appears please see resetting video. Pairing the thermostat to the programmer. Lower the cover on the front of the programmer. Move the selector switch to the run position. Press and hold the minus button for 5 seconds. The wireless connect screen will appear. Open the thermostat by pressing the button on the bottom. There are two buttons, reset and code, located on the printed circuit board. Press the code button once. The available zones on the programmer will begin to flash. You can clip the housing back. On the programmer, press the zone select button of the zone you wish to connect the thermostat to. The wireless symbol appears on the screen. After 3 seconds, the thermostat will show R1 if paired to zone 1 of the programmer, or R2 if paired to zone 2 of the programmer. When R1 or R2 is displayed, press the hand wheel on the thermostat. The temperature of the wireless thermostat is now displayed on your programmer. Your room thermostat is now paired up with your programmer. To connect up the hot water cylinder thermostat is the same procedure. Repeat this process for the third or fourth zone if required. Download and set up the Ember app. Download the Ember app from the App Store or Google Play. You can scan the QR code above. Once the app has been installed, Follow the on-screen instructions in order to sign up your account. Ensure to check all your email folders including junk and spam. Alternatively, you can perform a search for Ember in your email. On the status screen, please choose the installer option if you are not the homeowner. On completion of the set, once the homeowner logs into the home, the installer will be removed from the user list. The homeowner will then become super admin of the home. Pairing your gateway to your internet router. 
Ensure your router is working off a 2.4 GHz frequency. Ember does not support internet routers with a 5 GHz frequency. On the Ember App Home setup screen, select Wi-Fi setup. The wireless network should be pre-populated in the SSID box. In this case, EPH. On iOS 13 and later, it is necessary to provide Ember permission to pre-populate the SSID. You can also manually enter your SSID if you didn't give permission. Enter your password from your wireless router, but do not press the continue button yet. Have a small flat screwdriver ready, and go to the gateway. Press the function button once and within one second press in the smart link button once. The red and green lights on the gateway will both begin to flash. Immediately press the continue button on your smart device screen. The pairing process can take up to 30 seconds. If a solid green light appears on the function button, the gateway is successfully paired with the internet router and you will automatically progress to the gateway code screen. Please allow 2 minutes for system to synchronize before you enter the gateway code. The gateway code, ID Wi-Fi code, is the bottom code on label located on the side of the gateway. Once you entered the gateway code, you can press the continue button. This will bring you to the home setup screen. If invalid gateway ID appears, please refer to the pairing the gateway to the wireless programmer section of this video and try pair again by following each step. Follow the on-screen instructions to set up name of the property, different zones and invite other users. On completion, the home screen of Ember app should then appear on your smart device. The setup is now completed. For full instructions and advanced settings, please refer to the installation instructions included. Thank you for choosing Ember.